lives. I know it's been a while, but this is the beginning of the next project. The idea is this one is crashed and we're going to take the motor in here that is good and put it in this one that is not crashed, but the motor is no good. So here we go. Now it's time to get this off the trailer and into the shop. One engine is out. I didn't intend on doing this tonight, but one thing led to another, and now there's an engine hanging in the air. <clears throat> and there we go. Not too bad. A couple hours. Here's where it was kind of a mess. Uh, tomorrow we'll get this one out of here. This is the broken one. Broken body but good engine. And we'll pull the other one in with a good body and a bad engine and uh, put this engine in the good body. And I'll have more friends here. So I'm gonna call it a night. See you tomorrow. Got the cars swapped out, and the one with the bad motor is going up on the lift. And my friends are here. And it's the next day. This is the one that's coming out. That's the one that's going in. At this point, we got the CV axles pulled out of the transmission. We have the exhaust loose. We have this motor mount loose. Uh, we're gonna try to not have to deal with the air conditioning, so we're gonna loosen the compressor and hopefully leave it in the car. And then the motor mounts and a couple of hoses and this motor is ready to come out. And then they're working on putting a new water pump in this engine and when they're done with that then we're going to swap and hopefully have it running by tonight. All right the car that needs a new engine the old engine is removed it is right here the transmission off of this engine is going to be taken off and put onto this engine 
the old transmission is going to go to a good cause and we're still trying to get the replacement water pump on the new engine just so we only have to do this once but we're getting there Probably on the fender. That one actually looks pretty good. Yeah. Old, old motor, old transmission, replacement engine, all put back together, original transmission. Now we just need to make this connect into that and we can put it back into here and be done. This is it for this day. Uh, we have a bit more to do. Finish up tomorrow. Uh, this is quite a long day. But we got the bad motor out. Here's the other transmission. And we got the good motor back in the car. Transmission back in the car. Uh, everything is bolting up nicely, connecting all the hoses, connecting all the wires. Uh, that's pretty much it. Trying to just put everything back together the way it was. Uh, tomorrow we'll be finishing up the wiring, putting the battery in, uh, double and triple checking all of the torque and uh, hose clamps and electrical connections. Uh, putting the body panels back on and then uh, hopefully we can start it up and drive it out of here All right, it should be the last day only a few more hours of work left probably uh, We're gonna try to get this thing running uh, this evening and Hopefully my buddy can drive it home and he doesn't have to worry about it anymore So this is it. Engine is in. Got all the fluids. Got the battery. And it's running wonderfully.
And that's it. The car is fixed out of the garage. The donor car is in the garage for now. Motor and transmission. I might be using these leather seats on the Volkswagen project, so stay tuned for that. And uh, I do need to do a lathe project. That will be coming up soon, um, hopefully. But yeah, till next time, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Please like and subscribe if you're not already. Leave a comment with any thoughts below, and I'll see you on the next video.